We're joined by Indians pitching coach Mickey Calloway on the eve of the New York Yankees and the best of five. And you really threw a curveball to the baseball world yesterday when it was announced you'd go with Trevor Bauer and Kluber in game two. Take us and walk us through that. Well, you know what? I think we had um, a ton of meetings about this. To I make bet. sure we're doing the right thing. And after all the meetings that we had and all the information, it made some sense to do what we're going to do. So I won't walk you through everything because we don't have enough time, but uh, we really feel like this is going to really help us throughout the postseason, not only this series, but moving forward. And, uh, you know, our goal is to win every game, and we think this gives us the best chance to do that. Mickey, um, you had a great series against the Yankees at Yankee Stadium. You swept them in a three-game series. You split a four-game series here. Are they a different team now from the last time you saw them? They are. You know, I think that obviously we were in the middle of something special when we faced them last time, and they're coming off a great win yesterday. So, and this is the postseason. And they've got some guys that have played in the postseason before. Now they have some young guys too, but uh, the postseason is always different. we got to go out there, concentrate on making the next pitch no matter what happens, and we'll be just fine. So tomorrow night you'll go out there, you're going to take Trevor Bauer out there, you'll be on that bullpen with him, and you'll get a look at him before he comes in here. This place will be going crazy. Tell me this, you'll know Bauer's on when you see what? You know what, when, uh, when he comes out of the game, uh, you can't ever dictate what's going to happen by a guy warming up in the pen. And that's in the postseason, during the regular season, in spring training. So, you know, we're going to know uh, when he's on, you know, when the finished product comes in after he pitches. Were you impressed, you know, as a pitching coach with how the Yankees maneuvered their bullpen last night to get here to Cleveland? I mean, Wow, what a nightmare to have your starter go out in the first inning and he doesn't get out of the first inning. You know what? I think we're going to see that a lot this postseason. I think that uh, that's one of the reasons they're here. Their strength is their bullpen, and they can cover eight and a third or eight and two-thirds innings and uh, pitch really effectively. So that's what really makes them dangerous. They can turn a game into a very short start. Your pitching staff, it's so competitive. Each guy goes out there. I mean, it's not even quality starts anymore. You just take that for granted. But, I mean, what has it been like dealing with all of these personalities who are so unified for the one cause? You know what? That's made, that's made it the most fun uh, that I've ever had you know, in my coaching career, my playing career, is being around guys that day after day are competing against each other in a really good way, whether it's running, lifting, yeah. on the mound, Whatever it is, they're always trying to outdo each other, and we've got guys leading each other along. We just had our advanced meeting with the starters, and everybody was giving their opinion, and that's what makes them so good is that they run the show, they lead each other, and uh, we just get to observe. Last year you did some unique maneuvering, cobbling together that bullpen because you had injuries. I mean, we were seeing Andrew Miller in the fifth yeah. inning. Do you have to do that this year? I mean, you're much healthier. You know what? I think it totally depends on what the game is. It dictates. I think that uh, if we need to bring Andrew Miller in the fifth to win the game that day, we're going to do it. So, uh, you know, it's hard to predict what guys are going to do and how far they're going to go. All I know is that once a guy stops becoming effective, the next guy is going to be coming in. Boy, there is nothing like this. I'll tell you what. I mean, it's electric here today. This is just a workout. And tomorrow night, it is going to be great. Mickey, best of luck. Yeah, thanks a lot. Appreciate it.